Today, Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders spoke to lawmakers in her first State of the State address. Yeah, that speech helped kick off the 2024 fiscal session. There's a lot to unpack as legislators consider where to spend your tax dollars. THV 11 Sarah Horbakowitz is live at the Capitol to break it all down. Sarah. Yeah, Faith, it certainly was a busy day here at the Capitol. Education, crime, health care, those were just a few of the topics Sarah Huckabee Sanders covered in her State of the State address. Now, as the fiscal session begins, a big focus is on her $6.3 billion proposed budget, funding that will impact parts of everyday life for Arkansans. As the 2024 fiscal session began, Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders took the podium, highlighting issues she said she's been working to address since she took office. 45th in the nation for literacy, the highest tax burden in the region, the highest violent crime rate in the nation. And discussing how her proposed $6.3 billion budget could focus on those issues. We are building a better, a safer, and a stronger Arkansas. Our priorities are reflected in the budget. A majority of the estimated $109 million budget increase would go towards education, with most of those funds going towards the Learns Voucher program. Supported by Secretary of Education Jacob Oliva. We make sure that as we put forth the state budget for education, we have the right amount in there for parents that want to be a part of the Freedom Accounts. And an estimated $3.8 million would go towards funding state police. But beyond budget, hot topics at the Capitol are bills that address Act 851, a law passed last year that protects crypto mining facilities. Now, legislators like Stephen Meek say they regret supporting it. So we've got to get at least two-thirds of the members to support something. Uh, at this point, uh, obviously the details are important, but for my constituents, uh, I want to see us get something done before this is over. Sanders also mentioned working to phase out state income tax, but Senate President Bart Hester says the details of that won't be discussed until the end of this fiscal year, which comes later this summer. We'll continue following this fiscal session over the next few weeks, but for now, reporting from the Capitol, Sarah Horbakowitz, THV 11 News.